Hi everyone, this update about Polygon Matic. Polygon Matic is still struggling in that my particular price target area, guys. And I still not yet subscribe the channel. Subscribe the channel, press the like button, leave a comment, guys. That's how you're motivating me. And before continuing to watch the video, please press the like button as well, guys. So we'll talk about what's really going on in a Polygon Matic and why Polygon Matic is still struggling that particular price target. So everyone remember pretty much my price target 786 FIP level and 887 FIP level and we already landed that particular area and after that we dropped below the 887 as well and immediately recovered as a V-shape recovery you guys can see that one and move higher and higher after that sorry guys in a first attempt we already touched in a 786 FIP level and we dropped drastically and the day the way it dropped I told you I should consider as a wave 1, this is going to be the wave 2, this wave 3 and pretty much we saw the wave 4 as well. This is super bullish wave count guys and I would like to see to confirm the price in here as a purple wave 1 that is the in a sustainable uptrend. The first wave should be in here and the first wave count, the fifth wave could be in this price target area. $1.20 fills and $1.58 fills guys in between now the scenario why we are struggling actually we are struggling because of not matic because of not anything because of bitcoin bitcoin have uncertainty doubt about the market and bitcoin still did not make a sustainable uptrend and started it did not move the higher prices and the one more scenario we already have a four hour in a so uh, rsi we already break and two time fake out from here as well right now pretty much again trying to move higher and the the facing upside and there is one more trend line you guys can see if i if i show you it's pretty much easier to get to know and still you did not check my previous polygon video you guys get to know that one easily and the polygon have the same the trend line same as the bitcoin same as ethereum as well in rsi pretty much we hit the first time and the second time third time we break that level and started to move higher make double top scenario equal that is got equal measure moves guys 79 79 if you check that one 100 was an equal this high and here as well the most of the time we hit that above 75 it started to drop that's what I need to tell you guys. That's pretty much clearly. If we go above 75, started to drop. That meaning started to drop the prices. That's what I seeing right now. Even though this movement to upside, same we had here, it started to drop and move higher. And the similar, similar kind of move, even though you can consider, okay, we drop it here, drastically move higher, again dropped. The similar kind of move we dropped here and we go higher. Might be we going to see one more deep price guys and the price going to be dropped back again my expectation price drop is in a uptrend i would like to see not below that and that actually is a four hour the price is already touched here otherwise it's going to be invalidated totally so need to be hold pretty much that 250 period moving average to raise till here that's my uh, look out guys now the racing 50 period moving average polygon matic need to hold the price until here to move out of right now trying to move out of that 50 period moving average in the daily daily uh, chart guys if i zoom out you guys can see that one clearly we get the bounce back from there the 50 period moving average in the daily uh, daily chart that bounce is huge bounce guys till the time now way far away from uh 50 period moving average in a daily chart 50 period is strong moving average it's fake out is going down as well you guys can see the first time we fake out from here we drop it here i talk about this fake out as well and after we break out that 50 period moving average we retest and started to move higher and particular same you guys see this is called retesting as i i always talk about we are going to retest that same particular level and we already touch here start to move higher you guys can see in the next the candle after starting to move higher the next candle week is already in the previous high level guys that's one of the scenario you guys need to be monitor how to enter 
when the uptrend started that's what you guys need to learn and i always give my price target that particular price target is accurate if someone entered in a 60 to 70 fills level so right now he is super profit almost 50 percentage gain from his total investment and someone who followed my previous the my the first try, uh, price target 33 fills level he's already get the 2x gain guys that's what i need to tell you so because i cannot tell you you can you can enter now because i'm not financial advisor to give that kind of signal but i'm not giving signal i giving the probabilities that's you guys can decide the the way i give the way i explain my view and the, how the price reaction on that particular target area you guys believe it's started to move so that's your own decisions and that's your own risk guys so after we started to move higher, right now my expectation if i draw this one to move higher like this and this one pretty much come down here or either down here but not to go below than this particular area not to go below than 70 fills either here we touch here and start to move higher any area we need to see the prices reaction and i believe personally next uh pump is here after we touch in a daily chart uh 50 period moving average guys that is the one of scenario if we check it out where the price going to be in 100 period moving average the 100 the 100 always even the 100 see next next bounce we touch in 100 so it's still 100 is in a downtrend guys 100 moving down now we already crossed the 100 we are going to see the uh, 50 is going to cross the 100 that is the one of bullish scenario guys the bullish scenario so 50 going to move uh, across the 100 period moving average we'll see where the 200 period moving average actually i did not check in a daily chart 200 period moving average in where where the 200 i don't see any 200 oh. 200 is still 200 coming way far away from there and even you you guys see that on my price target how relevant it is because if we go above that one we are in a long term uh, uh, bullish scenario guys in a bullish scenario the in a long term because you know why we are already above on a daily chart 200 period moving average that is called super bullish and right now 50 starting to move higher i will draw something because i don't have a i don't have something to put this three chart together and it's easy i will try next time to give 50 is moving higher and 100 is here i think so 100 is coming down and 200 is coming down so this is the 200 crossing here and the 50 moving higher one first uh golden cross and the second golden cross here might be the way of move this is just the imagination how i'm imagining how the price move i will try to catch up and with the three indicators together how the price move guys that's what i need to tell you as well so this all about uh polygon matic still i did not see significant changes still the in my price target area one dollar three fills and 81 fills in between the possibility to break out but is still struggling on it so why is struggling on it because of the wave for invalidated area in one dollar uh, three fills guys anyway uh, hopefully you already press the like button before continue the video and it's going to be end the video thank you very much guys be safe be careful wait for tomorrow you guys see the what i talk about the price move most probably is going to be consolidate in this particular area in case of we did not break out from here either we will come down and touch that 200 period to get the bounce from there that is the one of major scenario going to be happen right now possible scenario in a portly gone matic thank you very much have a lovely day be safe